Stephen Hensley with 2HP. We've got eight new modules coming out January 30. Starting with a voltage controllable clock, very simple, rate control, two ranges, so you can go from glacially slow to fast to fast to well into audio rate. That also features a pause with a gain in to support that as well. Next up, we've got Burst, which is a burst generator. You'll hear that in the patch that's going on right now on the lead. It's taking one trigger and generating a series of triggers that follow. You get voltage control and a knob to control the rate at which the bursts follow, as well as the number of pulses in the burst. We've got a new gate routing module. It is a one input to four output voltage controlled switch. You can use voltage to route and send one rhythm to multiple places in your modular. Further down, we've got an ADSR. It's very simple, very short range to a long range. Knobs for attack, decay, sustain, and release. Further down, we've got a sample and hold. It's an analog sample and hold, as simple as it can be, and there's two completely separate channels of it. Further down, we've got a touring machine. The touring machine has a probability control, which when far left, will pick a new random value for that step of the sequence every time a trigger is present at the input. On the opposite side of the knob, it will lock the existing sequence into place and not choose new random values. In between, it will occasionally choose new values, otherwise it will continue to play the sequence. You also get voltage control and a knob to control the range or the number of steps in your sequence from 2 to 32 steps. At the bottom of the module you get an amplitude. This amplitude doesn't affect the output of the sequence but instead influences the new random values that come in so it limits the range of the new voltage. The next new module we have is the EG. It's a attack decay envelope with trigger input, CV over attack and decay, linear exponential switching, as well as an amplitude output to scale your output from 10 volts down to 0 volts. The last new module that we're going to release next week is the VCA. It is a two-channel linear VCA. The knobs are attenuators for the incoming CV, and when there's no CV present, they act as a bias control. So those are the eight modules that we're going to be releasing January 30. We're very excited about them. Is that good? Yeah, it's great.